Social networking sites like Facebook are a great way to stay connected with friends and, ne and network with other people. But as Cronkite reporter Maxine Park shows us, some of these sites are re redefining the meaning of a friend. I don't think it's the kind of meaning of a friend that we grew up on. Michelle Gutierrez is a Facebook user. Network with other people. And like most people, she gets friend requests from coworkers, family members, and classmates. Just like interact with the people that I've already established as Facebook friends. But on her tally of friends, she has a few, and then some. I've got 2,000. 226 friends. But how many of them are really her friends? I've probably met 75% of my Facebook friends, somehow. Social networking sites like Facebook are changing the definition of what a friend is, but it's leaving some people asking who their friends really are. Like 285? 603. I have 1,092 friends on Facebook. I usually just add people I pretty much always talk to. Facebook definition of friend different than what the real, I think, the real definition of a friend is. Basically for networking, I think, is the Facebook, the reason for the Facebook friend. Gutierrez says this new kind of friendship is all a part of the ever-changing social media culture. This friend in this sense is, means like, I have something in common with you and we're connected more so than I care about you, I want to hang out with you. Either way, Gutierrez believes it's a new way to define friendship for a new generation. There's gonna be this whole new elevation of relationships just based off of online social networking sites like Facebook. Relationships with people you've never even met. In Phoenix, Maxine Park, Cronkite News.